full on storm out there. I'm gonna get so, so wet. <laughs> oh man. There's an absolute deluge outside the car. As soon as I step out, I'm gonna be saturated, even with the waterproofs. <laughs> They'll just wet out. I've got about a one and a half to two hour walk in this massive rainstorm to get to where I'm staying tonight. So hopefully, well, no, I'm gonna get wet. There's nothing I can do about it. So I just gotta push on, get to destination <laughs> and enjoy this epic walk. As you can see, there's just a lot of water on the ground and in the air and all over me. This rain is relentless, full blown. The tracks just turned into a full on river. <laughs> This is quite crazy. Quite a lot of rain. Far out. It's coming in with some power. Oh, I need goggles for this. Oh yeah. Door. Now it's rather intense up here. Feet might get wet here. Not good. I made it through, but my boots are full of water after that one. It was about knee deep. Hopefully it doesn't rise more so I can get out tomorrow, but I think there's a few more to cross. The river's getting full. I reckon I can cross it over there. It's going pretty fast, but it's not too deep. I can probably hold on to that tree and get across, hopefully safely. I'll put the camera away and I'll just go across, keeping a tight grip on that branch. Well, my boots are absolutely completely soaked now. That was quite well over my knees crossing that river. So <laughs> there's no way I can get around that. Welcome to the shelter. <laughs> it's absolutely coming down and I'm drenched. My feet are soaked. I don't know what's going on under the rain jacket, but I'm probably wet. It's pretty cool to be here. It was quite a mission to get in. Welcome to inside the cabin. I've got to get these wet clothes off and get something dry on. It's not exactly cold, but I just don't want to be wet. this rain eases a bit because if it doesn't those creeks that I crossed on the way in they're going to be higher and I have to get over them tomorrow oh man 
What have I done? At least I've got coffee, but I'm out of that rain now and the shelter. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. It's crazy loud in here. Holy cow, man, listen to that rain. Got a nice fireplace in here. I'll get that going later, it'll be super cozy. But first, I'm gonna get my chair set up, and then I'll probably get some dry clothes on. Um, there is a few like benches in here, but I can recline back on my chair, so I'll use this. candles that's a bit romantic set the mood in here for my hot dogs later I'm gonna get that big sausage in the bun I've got six buns and six sausages it's gonna be deluxe just need to get a fire going and we're all set Some wood, check this out. New saw. This thing's a big beast. A little blade on that. Make mince meat of this wood. New saw. It's way better. Nice. Okay, people. I'm gonna get this fire going. I've got my uh, trusty little Lucifer fire starter. I'll just build a little fire in there. And you know the drill. It's probably gonna get burned like straight away. It's pretty wet, but I think it should get going. Listen to that rain. Crikey. Ah. Now we're talking, it's like a little home in here now. Cozy. <laughs> I'm so wet, man. I'll do a few more jobs, then I wanna get changed and get dry. That was hectic. Thumbs up for massive rainstorm. Look at that fire, it's cranking. Considering how much rain came down, I'm actually pretty much dry apart from a sweat. This jacket's epic. The halo, Hunter's Element. I bet y'all be able to dry it out too, or hang it up. 
and by the morning it'll be dry. Oh, these pants. Get these off too. What a mission. The river has risen a lot, so getting out tomorrow is going to be pretty hectic. Pretty dry. I'm steaming. Look at all that water evaporating off me. I'm gonna be super dry. Oh, I'm not sure what time it is because it's so dark because it's like full storm. It's probably like 5 or 6 p.m. <laughs> it's so loud in here. I'm starting to get real hungry. I think it's time for hot dogs. This rain is absolutely insane. I want to get washed away. Done. These brioche buns, man, they are the best. The same brand as the buns that I usually have for my burgers, but this time I'm having these deluxe ones for the hot dogs. Get that sausage right in the bun. Victoria's not here to make silly jokes but you all know the drill. <laughs> Woohoo! Right so in here we got some premium pickles. I'll tuck those down the side of the dogs. Now I know some of you think pickles on a dog is a bit gross. Pickles in general are gross. Ah, pickle juice on my fingers. I reckon pickles are nice. Ketchup. Because I love it. And in here we got some of the good old Frenches. I like it because it's sweet and tangy. I don't want spicy mustard on my dogs. This is my entree. Hot dogs in the storm. Let's go. Oh, no, I'm so happy I brought six of them. Oh, the brioche goes so nice, it's sweet and soft. Mm. Tangy smokiness of the dog. Guys, some of you in the comments suggested that I know why you go camping, you do it for the food. 
<laughs> that was an accurate comment. My dog's steaming. Oh man, this fire is so hot. That's insane. Oh my dog number two. Pickle on that one. Look at that. Maybe I should have brought 10. Oh my goodness, the rain's back. Okay, dog number three. I think the third one's the best so far. Oh yeah. Four, five, six. Starting to feel pretty good. No. Oh. Okay, I'm starting to feel pretty full. Number five. They still taste just as good, man. Here we go, people. That wasn't even too much. I reckon I could do four more. I'd like dessert now. A big cheesecake would go good. Man, that rain. It's relentless. Got to venture outside. The rain has stopped. But it's very windy. And it's real misty out here. You can just hear that wind. It's cloud like rushing through here. <laughs> Man, there's a lot of water in there. Time for a hot chockey. Now I reckon it's bedtime. I'm very tired. I think I might be sick. I just feel really run down. Usually I would be charging around, no issues, up on the tops. But for some reason, I just feel exhausted on this trip. Maybe it was that in insane rain. Walking in the real heavy rain is quite draining. Could have been that. Anyway. This will be good after all those hot dogs. Ooh, nice little hot chocky. Hopefully there's not too much rain overnight. It's raining now, but nothing like it was before. So it'll be good if it just settles down and I can chill out tomorrow, have my pancakes, relax, have a nice morning, probably get the fire going again. And then have a nice cruisy walk out without any, any major disruptions. I think I spoke too soon. The heavy rain's back. Just got my low power quilt today. It's actually so hot in here. That fire's insane. So like being in a house with an open fire. Anyway, I'm gonna get into bed and I'll say goodnight. I was gonna sleep in the tent. Like I said, I did bring it with me. But with this level of rain and having the hut, I was going to take the hut this time. It's been a pretty epic night. I've really enjoyed it. Those hot dogs are insane. And just being out here, man, it's quite a different, unique experience. We'll see what tomorrow brings. Hopefully, it's not so much rain. But I'm going to try and sleep now. I'm pretty tired. It's real hot in here. So, good night, everyone. See you tomorrow. Good morning everybody. I have awoken to no rain, which is, you know, it's preferable for me right now. 
it was absolutely pouring down over the night uh kind of coming and going so i was waking up a bit but right now it's absolutely peaceful here i've got my real nice coffee the fire's going again i just had to restock the embers and it's quiet apart from the roaring river in the background so i'm just gonna lie in bed have this and i'm feeling pretty hungry again actually I'm looking forward to the pancakes quite nice waking up and not being in a tent but still being out in nature <clears throat> for a change it's a pretty nice morning I think the rain's gonna hold off and my socks are completely dry which is very very nice <laughs> the last pancake she's a big one we'll go for the flip oh need more power there we go I'm probably gonna have to go on a diet after this man look at that lovely golden brown look at the stack Queen's maple syrup the ultimate pancake stack I think I might eat these outside. Okay, I've got the ultimate pancake stack. And I'm out here outside my cabin. This is nice, man. This is real nice. And a week has come to join me. Oh yeah, it's absolutely drowning in maple syrup. Look at this man, fluffy pancake after the massive storm out here in nature. Truly delightful. I wonder, yeah, you can see the wicker. Come here, want some pancake? These pancakes, man, they're so divine. And I think the rain's kind of maybe coming back now. It's quite dark out that way. Check out that fluffy goodness. Thank God for maple syrup. Good on you Canadians. Mm. This has been a culinary experience, man. Those hot dogs, these pancakes. Everything about this has been pretty epic. Oh. I'm gonna finish these and just soak in this ambience. There's lots of birds flying around here, it's amazing. Alright everybody, I'm all packed up, put the fire out, and it looks like it's starting to rain again, unfortunately. So it's going to be a 
two hour walk out in the rain, but that's okay. I'm already kind of wet in this shirt anyway. But it's been an awesome camp and I'm gonna enjoy the walk out. And I'll come back to you on the GoPro. Let's begin the trek back. And it looks like the weather's turned again, so <laughs> should be fun. Goodbye to this nice little hut. Serves me well. Maybe I'll come back one day. Like I said before, let me know if you like the hut camps. They're pretty cool and there's lots of huts I could go to. But yeah, it's gonna be about two hours back out. I'm quite looking forward to it. I've got to burn off those pancakes and all those hot dogs. Here we are, back at the river. And it's come down so much. That's incredible. I'm pretty sure it's pushed this log. It pushed it. I'll have to check the footage when I get home, but this was like a raging torrent the other day. Now it's back to like a nice little stream. Look how much that's come down. I should be able to get across this as piece of cake now. Oh! <laughs> yeah, yesterday, that was insane. Back up on the saddle. It's a bit of a breeze up here. This was the location yesterday where I was getting absolutely like water blasted with rain. But it's looking pretty nice and misty. It's nice to get a bit of a wind chill. It was hot walking through the forest. But I think it's about half an hour more or so. Back to the wagon. Very wet now. But almost back at the car. Quite thirsty. Up in my mouth, get some raindrops on the tongue. What a glorious sight. Well, that was the camp, back in the wagon. I'm gonna drive out. It's about an hour commute back to the home. But that was a pretty awesome experience, being in the, um, the hut and the massive rainstorm and the walk-in, you know, and the six hot dogs. It's pretty awesome. Just wanna say a special thanks to the members. Little community of members is growing, so it's pretty cool, and I really appreciate the continued support. It means a lot. Um, for you guys to you know show that support because it takes a lot of effort to make these videos but i'm gonna head home clean myself up and probably go to the pub and get some chippies man because i'm wet and getting a bit hungry again so <laughs> i'll see you next time guys bye bye